this is just a bit of a follow-up of what I got last night. <laughs> We've been spending all afternoon doing this, sorting this doof out. June and I. She got the mouth open thinking oh, I done it all myself. No, I didn't. It was from June herself. What we've done is what we've done, we've actually gone through, counted up each individual item, what they are, how many we've got, what we got um, on the ute here. But anyway, I'll start way, way, way out the back over here. Um, this was from the electrical place that I usually go to. Tested the microwave out doesn't work so it's going to be scrapped out these big speakers here they are aluminium so that'll be all pulled apart and what not and that, not that sort of way i did think about this one here connecting it up to me wireless but i thought no i don't want to do that don't want to let everyone know what i'm listening to um some bit of a wire here another light a uh, bit of steel as well so yeah uh this is what we got in the cans Pardon me. Uh, that's what we got in the cans. We did get oh, about three or four bottles in glass anyway, but that's what we got. So it's only about a oh, small bit in there. Uh, two multi meters that came out of all of the merch that's over there. Um, we'll get, that we'll get to that shortly. Now, June did count up how many batteries I got out of that one over there. Uh, where are the batteries, babe? You can go run through the batteries. Right, she we... even she even went through it and counted uh, on what size they are, like the CR twenty thirty twos. How many how many packets there are? But see, there's only some there with that one. There's going to got a half a packet. So yeah. So how much you got there? I got eighteen of twenty thirty two. Right. I got seven of twenty sixteen. Where are they? Oh, there. No, no, no. Here. Oh, there. I've got three A76, which there. is there. They're the small, more small little ones. I've got uh, one 2430. That's a big fat battery, that. One 2450. I'll go along the line like this. How's that? Two 1660, three 3032. They have been painted and spray painted, so yeah. One. 120. That's a 2025, that one. That's a 2025. So you got one 1220. Uh, two 2025. Yeah, one of these. There's 1620s. Yes. And you got about four, four 2020s. Uh, 1620s. Uh, that's in those batteries. I uh, got a bit of wire out of it as well. Also got, uh, I, I do remember getting these three drinks out of there too. They are factory sealed. So we'll be cleaning them up and putting them in the fridge. Uh, also some Black Ridge. Uh, pressure gauges. Five of them, digital pressure gauge. Yep. And we got wheelbarrow. Uh, a wheelbarrow. <laughs> wheelbarrow. A wheelbarrow. Uh, it is a used wheelbarrow. Um, I'll explain what's actually wrong with it up here. Got a few cracks and they've fixed it up and God knows what. I don't think it's holding concrete. And that's, why, that's why they threw it away. Um, we are going to be doing a bit of a test with that too. Uh, the tyres a bit flat, <laughs> so we've got a. Push by pump up here, well there's four of them. Um, I'll do that straight away. Pass the camera over to June. So she can observe what I'm doing. Alright, now this has got the digital thing on the on the bottom, so we're turning on. There we go, we're on. This is the test to see if these work. Seeing there's four of them. Unscrew the cap. Always put it on your bolt, you can never use it, lose it. Never put it in your mouth, you don't know whether a dog's been peeing on it. That one there, you mongrel of a thing. Oh, it's got two holes. Yes, it's got two holes oh. in it. Here we go. I can't get that on there. She's dead flat. No, it didn't go on. I'm useless doing this, eh? There we go. I think I got it on. That's what happens when you're doing things like this. It's oh on. yeah, it's on. That's a pump away. Oh, that's going up. It's got a long stroke. Yeah, it's going up. It's going up. 
It's currently on 6.5 PSI. Good back exercise, Dale. Oh, what are we up to? Nearly 16 PSI. That's far uh, enough. You did pump it up pretty quick. Yeah. What's that up to? 22. So it works. Make you wonder why they threw it away. I'll pump it up to 30. Oh. You don't want to go bang. No, it won't go bang. That's 28. Next 28. Hey, that done pretty good. Pretty damn good, that. What was that, Barney? Hey, put the cover back on. It has also got on the side here. In here, all the extra little bits and pieces too. Like for the balls and stuff, needle nose. Like you've got one needle nose and whatever else you got there. So that's all attached to... I don't know what that one is. What's that? Ooh. Oh, that'd be for a valve. Yeah. Probably. Um, so that's all attached to the push bike pump. We've got four of those. So, yeah. Okay. Um, now, when it comes down to the vernies, we've got four, four vernies. Now, I have not tested to see if these work. So I'm just going to pull the tab out. Ooh. There it goes. There we go. One handed for everyone. Zero out. Mind the one handed action. Zero. She's working. No problems whatsoever. So they, that one works. So if that one works, probably the rest work because they all have the tabs in them. See, that one's got the, the paper tab in it and that sort of thing. So that's good. I was after a couple more pairs. Um, how many water bottles, though? Uh, These water bottles here, there. You got 33 of them. 33 of those. Uh, what, what else you got there? 33 of those. Um, uh, I, I threw her out of whack here. Yes, you did. <laughs> right. Down here. All right, we're going to come back down here, everyone. We've got 13 stubby holders. Right. Which is different ones. Yeah, we've got different lots we've of stuff. We've got a albums. solar hula girl. Yep. We've got three pens. We've got 32 key rings. And they have a light in the end. Little light in the end. Mm -hmm. Oh, June got it working. There we go. But you've got to make sure you turn it off. Yeah. They're not a not a chargeable thing. Now, that's where some of those batteries would be handy if you ever go flat. We've got so those we've got two. one key ring. Oh, one, one key ring holder. Which is just, looks like it's a it shock. It looks like a shock. Then we've got 16 Namolus washer. It's a wash. You put it in a bucket of water and you wash your car with. Yeah, whatever. It's 30 millimetres. 30 yep. mils. You've got 16 of them. You've got seven egg. Oh, yeah, with the egg flips. Barbecue got, egg flips. Got them over here holding the stickers down. You've got seven. You've got three pens. You've got, as, as we just said, we've got 33 water bottles. Yeah, 33 water bottles. You've got two ultimate wash and wax then you've got seven keep calm air freshener car a new one we've got three strawberries these ones here they, these are your car fresheners uh two orange uh no vanillas and we've got eight orange fair fresheners where are they got, oh yeah here. Um, yep and we've got uh what do we say where were they well no, the tradie ones. Uh, What's the tradie one? Tradies, you've got four of them. Right. And then you've got, got the Angry Bird Angry pack of Bird, three. Which is packet of three. They're all different um, freshness, these ones. Then we've got 11 oh, balls. Oh, they're, they're a blow up, blow -up ball. Balls. We've got 31 can holders. And we've got 
uh, eight small stickers and seven large Penrite stickers. Penrite, darling. Then we've got six Project stickers. Then you've got one Aeroflow sticker. One no. Fusion, Fusion sticker. Fusion sticker. Where's it? Aeroflow. It's there. That one. That one. That one there. And you and you've got six rocket. These ones here. Yeah. Oh, but then see these ones at the bottom, they can come off too. Yeah, and as we said, we've got the five. Yeah, you have got the got that stuff over yeah, there. Already um, done all now that. also done. And we've got um, five. Uh, two five. Uh, you got, we've got five. Oh, well, I just said it was wire. Yeah. Um, but yeah, we got two batteries. The turntable I was able to get out of the bin there. Um, I can't believe on how heavy that was. That was unreal. Uh, these things were just as heavy. You can see how damaged they were. I think they're to do with brakes or something like that because the brake pads were with them. Um, that's part of it. We haven't quite finished over here. We've got... Um, 30, 32 bags that we've went through here these bags they're a super cheap bag uh some of them have got holes it looks like mice have got to them and that's oh, why they tore them. or they could have tore them or something like that now i uh, didn't finish we've got a couple of extras here uh, that you might have seen in the video and this is a vehicle positioning jack now i have had a shot at it trying to get it to work uh it seems like the plunger may need replacing on the on the o-ring um or it might need a little bit more oil i have seen when i've been playing around with it that this bleed screw is a bit bent so i'll get around to trying to get that done um this one here is a vehicle uh what is it what's it say vehicle dolly that's all this is so once you've got your you got to have four of these to actually put them up and move your vehicle around so you put once you get your vehicle up you can put your vehicle down on your wheels into that and that's why it's shaped the way it is and you can move your vehicle around in it like a 360 degree. So anyway, that was a bit of a mix up for us. I have been very busy trying to get a lot of the piano that I picked up dismantled. Um, I received it in bits and pieces, like just the, the top frame and the bottom frames and that sort of thing. Um, and a lot there's a lot of timber in it, so I'll just flick you around and I'll show you what I'm talking about. So here... Um, here we're trying to get the cast iron off. Um, I'm having an issue where the battery on the drill, um, I've got to drill these out, put the drill on them. Um, I've had, actually had to put the, a socket on upside down inside the drill to actually twist them out. I got down to about here, um, and that's where I'm up to. It's a bit hard when you've still got some of the uh, piano strings that are still attached. Once I get that lot out, I should be able to hopefully because this is all cast these are all steel um lifted off the timber so i've got that one there i've got to go through this one hit down here you can see it's got a fair bit on it um they're all different this one's upside down a fair bit of cast in that so yeah got to get rid of the timber off those and get that all separated i even received a load of scrap steel I was surprised on this one. I received it on a pallet. Not often you get them on a pallet, pallet wrap and all that sort of thing. Um, I think it's only shelving and stuff like that. So I haven't gone through it enough yet. I uh, picked this one up a couple of days ago. Oh, there's a bit of wire in there. Didn't even know that. Damn, that's a bonus. Drill bonus. Uh, couldn't even fold the tileboard up. They put it on with a forklift. They, they rang me up. I said, oh, yeah, you would, would you like this or would you take it? I said, yes, I'll take it. Um, I've just got to dispose of the wooden pallet, which we have a place we can do that. We've got a um, burn pile up here where we're allowed to burn once a year, every year. Uh, we don't need permits to do that, so we just do it whenever we can. We just let the fireys know. Um, so we're, so far we have one IBC pod full, chocolate block full. And I have been keeping all brake drums and brake pads and all the cast iron separate. So when, even the spring here, that's a big heavy spring. Um, so when we do go to have a scrap run, that sort of thing, we won't be going and doing a scrap one. I'll be emailing a follower and saying, look, I'm ready for you to come and pick some up. And that's what we'll be doing. And 
I hope hope he's welcome on putting himself on video but anyway he's the one that contacted me and uh, we're gonna go that way so we'll see what happens with that one so if you've come this far in the video everyone don't forget to give us a smash of a like button um, and uh, if you consider subscribing don't forget to hit the notification bell that way you'll get notified when there's a new video coming up now just on a small note about the fella that we were looking after and that sort of thing and the little dog that's down here on the ground little barney boy um we don't actually own barney the chappy that we were we're looking after well he's we're no longer looking after him because he's actually in hospital uh the poor fella he down to the stage where he cannot walk so and i've been looking after him for oh going on for about now four weeks the old fella because he's been in and out of hospital and that sort of thing uh just trying to help him out a bit wherever we can however we can like if we can donate some money to him and that sort of thing help him out with medication that's sort of thing that's what we've been trying to, trying to do um but in the sense of um we have not been able to help him in health wise because his health is just deteriorating so quick but anyway just thought i'd clarify that barney doesn't we don't own him um we're just taking care of him so any any anything that we get out of the cans we've been helping get food for barney uh medication that sort of thing uh, so yeah it may be looking that he might have to go to a some sort of physio and that sort of thing but anyway um enough of that hope you've been like tagging along with me today and uh, explaining a few things on what we got last night which is that was good was not expecting that out of super cheap but anyway till next time happy dumpster driving and i'll see you in the next one cheerio